the sites are not given directly instead they give ratio of the sites 3 is to 5 is to 7 whenever they give ratio what we have to do let the side be 3x the side b be 5x the side c be 7x like we will take one unknown okay now also given that perimeter is 300 meters so perimeter means a plus b plus c is equals 300 so a is how much 3x plus 5x plus 7x is equals 300 we have 15x is equals 300 how much is x 20 got it when x is 20 how much is the length of a 3 2 is a 60 b is come on answer answer man now we need to find the area of this triangle how we can find the area square root of s into s minus a s minus b into s minus c s we already have this 300 right is that s is 300 semi perimeter half of it okay so here s is equals 150 so square root of 150 into 150 minus a is 60 into 150 minus b is 100 into 150 minus c is 140 now simplify this we may end up having square root of 150 into uh, 150 minus 60 it is 90 into there 150 minus 100 50 into at last 10 so it is easy that we can take factorizing this all of its are multiples of 10 so this one I am going to write it as uh, 3 into 5 into 10 because 15 into 10 we can write directly I am writing 3 into 5 into 10 and then 90 we can write it as 9 into 10 I am writing because 9 can be taken out from the root and then 50 can be written as 5 into 10 and then 10 can be written as it is now we have to find such squares look at this for these two 5 1 5 can be taken out for these two 10 1 10 can be taken out for these two 10 again 1 10 can be taken out remaining anything could be taken out this 9 for the 3 can be taken out and then here root 3 so we have 10 tens are 100 100 into 5 500 500 into 3 1500 root 3 square units no not square units they given 300 meter right yes meter square okay here when you write abc also see 60 meter 100 meter 140 meter i guess you can write so what would be the therefore statement therefore the area of the triangle is 1500 root 3 meters square that's all any doubts So far we have seen three type of question, one which directly find in that one side is hidden, next one application type of question, when to calculate area, when to calculate perimeter, third one ratio type of question, based on this we may have only five questions in our exercise. So we are going to start doing it right now, okay, just finish this, we will start the exercise.